I got out of the military 2013, active duty, and I became reserve. So I decided to move to Texas where I became an OCT, observer coach trainer. And when I moved to Texas, I didn't have a job. Um, I was sleeping in my car, I was homeless. I met this uh, young lady on the east side of uh, Fort Worth named Mar Marquita. And she basically told me that they were hiring for summer day camp counselors and uh, they needed help. So I ended up getting a day camp counselor job with the YMCA and it was amazing. I'm still sleeping in my car, nobody knew it. And uh, so the day camp came and I was, you know, I got, um, I got nominated for, you know, best camp counselor just because the kids loved me. Uh, I ended up taking the swim test for, to become a lifeguard so I can get more hours. The lifeguard class was just a different, just a totally different monster. So I didn't pass the lifeguard test the first time and it was said that, that no, I wasn't gonna pass it and I couldn't swim. And word got out that I was homeless and the Y came together and uh, just from gas money to checkups to even letting me shower at their homes, stuff like that, um, just the watches came together and just carried me, like ascended me. So I ended up getting an apartment and getting on my feet. I came back six weeks later and just just mutilized. I just I killed the, the lifeguard test. And uh, it was a breath of fresh air that was my silver lining. So anyway, I got promoted to head lifeguard and um, we started training, training, training. Our shadow drop was the fastest in the city of Fort Worth. Coming from that small branch, we beat everybody. Our, our uh, reaction time was six seconds. Our recovery time was 10 seconds. I started a nonprofit called Chambers Aquatics. And Chambers Aquatics' mission statement is to aggressively attack marginalized and poverty-stricken areas that don't have the assets to get water safety swim lessons. And in this current day, you're looking at a guy that come from, you won't be able to swim. So now I partner with the YMCA and I train all of the lifeguards um, with the assistance of all of the uh, aquatics coordinators across the city. It's amazing what the YMCA and the people of the YMCA came together and got done and how the Eastside YMCA took me in. I'm a small, I'm a small town kid from Memphis, Tennessee and the east side of Fort Worth took me in like their own and made sure that I didn't want for anything. And seven years later, I have a wife, three kids, and a, a passion like no other that stems from the YMCA.